Now that we have our photos and videos, video clips edited the way that we want them to be, um, I'll show you how to add transitions. So if we come up here to transitions, there's only a couple basic transitions that you're going to want to use. Um, probably this blur one is okay. Um, this dissolve one is okay, and fade to black is good. Any of these circle ones or swap or doorway or things like that look pretty hokey. So unless you have a really good reason for using them because it fits with something that you're doing in the video, um, I would probably avoid most of these and use probably fade to black like 99% of the time. So I'm going to grab this transition and bring it down. And I'm going to do that in between both of my clips. Um, if I want to reorder this, I could also drag my this video clip in front of the other one, even though in real life it happened in the reverse order. All right, so I have transitions in between all of those now, so it looks like this when I play the movie. can see the screen goes black and then back to the next clip. So that is transitions. I'll show you how to do titles now as well. So if we want to add a title to the beginning of our movie, then I come over here to title and you can choose the style that you want. I kind of like this line one. So I'll bring that down. And I'll say this is Cade's movie. Yeah, yeah. Great. And now when I play the movie, you can see that my title comes in. I can drag this to change where the title goes. You could put it on any, any place in the movie. And you can also alter how long it takes to display the movie, and how long it will be displayed for. Um, you can do that on videos as well. The process is the same. You could add a, a title or text there. And <clears throat> some of the editing things that you can do are over here. If you want to make it bold or italics or outlined. We can bring it to the left, to the right, to the center, change your font, 